Hey everybody, another video where we see something in the film Strategic Air Command and I show it to you in real life. In this episode, we're going to do the flight engineer panel. This is a uh, single flight engineer, an early model. Quickly, we'll look at the image from the flight handbook the D model flight handbook, which confirms that this panel is that of a D model. Now let's look at the artifact. Later model B-36 flight engineer panels featured smaller gauges for the fuel quantity. Here's an actual gauge that would have been used in this actual panel during that time period. This is for tanks three and floor. You can tell that this gauge came out of a B-36 because of the inspection stamps. This one was overhauled and it's CVSD, which is Consolidated Volte San Diego. Another one there is Consolidated Volte Aircraft Company or Corporation. It has a B-36 contract number on there if you can see it which is AC7. That contract was for the A models and I think some of the B models. This guy went about right there. The side of it would have been fuel tanks one and two, five and six. These are covered because these are the first type of oxygen regulating equipment. Uh, one gauge showed the quantity flow and another one, I really don't know what it did. <laughs> but those are the earliest ones. These were superseded by the D1 panels, which had all of the equipment that was behind this panel. And you could just see the indicators incorporated into a single panel. That single panel was late, later internally lit and became the D2. I think I said that right. These, then D1, then D2. Just showing you some of the details. It's not every day you get to see one of these in real life. This very well might be the only one on the planet. Who knows? It's made out of magnesium, cast magnesium with a little bit of weld on the back that you'll see. Let me turn it around. It weighs probably 10 pounds. a very early style which you would screw into the front with the screws later models featured a like a hoop that you would tighten and it would constrict the gauge and hold it in there here's a way you can determine if an artifact came from a b36 part number 36 B-36, F means it was a permanent fixture in the aircraft, which this was. Other numbers would be A for armament. I think H is hydraulics, B fuselage, E electrical. As you can see, it's made out of cast magnesium. These points here are the ball joints that would have had a, a rod that went out and attached to the bulkhead. These would have sat on shock pads or anti-shock pads, I should say. You can see very subtle amounts of welding here and there. But there you have it. A B-36D model single flight engineer main panel. See you next time.